This is F1 2020, I'm Mooney GT, and it's time for the Canadian Grand Prix. Grand Prix, Grand Prix, Grand Prix. Okay guys, welcome to Canada. It's qualifying. Practice has gone pretty well. I think we've got decent pace here. I have increased the difficulty of the AI because I think I'm starting to get a little bit better at this and catching up. Maybe the car is getting a little better. I don't know, but we've increased the difficulty up. I think we're at 57 or 58 now. When I started the series, it was at 50, so we're, we've, we've kicked it up a few notches here. We're about to hit, head out for Q1. Let's see what happens. All right, well, here we go, guys, Q1. We'll see what kind of pace we have today. Um, I think I'm doing pretty good around Montreal, but the, uh, the Apollo Racing Program car is feeling pretty good today. Feeling pretty racy, especially since we replaced all the broken parts from Monaco. Oh, this is a great lap, I think, right? For me, pretty good, not bad. Of course, we did get a warning from Jeff about our transmission wear. I really don't know what I'm supposed to do about that. I think we're doing all right here. Oh my gosh, now we're at P. We're, at, <laughs> we're too fast, guys. We're too fast. We'll take it, but I don't understand why. So we're going to hang out. Uh, guys, I'm a f I, I fear we may be starting from the front here. There's going to be a lot of pressure. I don't know. <laughs> If you've watched some of the recent live streams, you can see that I don't usually hold up to pressure. We've done it though, we're out of Q1, we're heading to Q2. It looks like track conditions have changed, it's definitely more overcast. Not a Jeff here, are you causing unnecessary wear to your transmission? Try to take it easy or you risk losing it. Guys, we're gonna have a transmission, oh is it raining? Uh oh. We'll just try to get one lap at this and hopefully get out of here without wrecking the car. I didn't sign up for rain. I'm a fair weather Formula One driver, for sure. Okay, slaps feeling clean if not fast. Oh, it was clean. That's not clean at all. We're not even gonna bother going back out in Q2 right now. If it's raining, the track's not gonna be any faster. We're already, um, we're already in third. There's nothing to be gained here, I don't think. It's full on raining. <laughs> this will be interesting. This will set us back down the field probably. Oh, it's proper raining. Oh man. Oh, we're spinning the tires in fourth. Pretty sure our gearbox is gonna break for some reason. I, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Jeff won't tell me what to do. Everything just feels like mush. Feels like someone put glue in my steering wheel. Oh, it's sketchy. Trying to break early, that was probably too early for there. Ooh, no grip, no grip. Oh, feel like it's getting slipperier. Slipperier, less grippier. We're P10 because that's all there is. <laughs> We'd be doing worse if there were more cars, right? You may struggle to get into gear at the normal speed. We're seeing a fault with the gearbox. <laughs> well, that's that's going to do it for qualifying, guys. We've had a gearbox failure. We've got to replace the gearbox. That's going to put us to the back of the grid. But at least we got to fix this in qualifying today, and we should be good to go for the race tomorrow. And hopefully the rain has gone away. Whew. You can see a little bit of dejection in my face. I was on lap 15 of 18 in the race and my computer had a hiccup and lost control of the car. So doing something I didn't really want to do and that's restart the race. I don't want races to be affected by my hardware, but um, if I make a mistake, we'll try to live with them. But uh, we're going to go ahead and get to this again. <laughs> we're starting from the back because of the gearbox penalty, but let's go racing in Canada again. Okay, so what did we learn in the first race? Well, we didn't learn anything we should have already known, and that's you've got to take care of the car. You can't damage the aero, in part because you can't afford the pit stop time, and in part because you can't um, afford the lap time. Wow, I thought maybe we'd actually picked up some spots, but none of it stuck. Well, we, we got in front of uh, Tatiana, which is great. Oh, and someone else too, I guess we got a couple. Oh dear. <laughs> you gotta be careful with the 
slow corners on the first lap. So what fuel mode are we in? We're in rich. We want to be in lean right now. Because all these slow cars and stuff, there's no reason to damage the engine. And honestly, I don't think we need the performance to keep up with traffic. Uh, maybe once things spread out a bit, this never works. Uh, I tried this a couple times in the first race. And you can get through there usually without getting hurt, but you just can't, um, you can't get the power down out of the corner to do anything with it. So we got to run on Latifi here. Oh my gosh, that was bold. All right, we made quick work of Latifi, which is good. Who's really getting on my nerves in the first race? The first attempt. I'm glad that we can put him behind us and move on to bigger and better things. AI is so slow through that corner. It's a tough one. But said we're going to try really hard to keep it clean. We'll go into standard fuel now. That we're clear of traffic a little bit. But I've got like the red mist going and because <laughs> I'm so amped up from the last race that uh, and I think I have some pace today. So like I've got all this motivation to actually try really hard to get by people because I think I can keep moving up the field if we can get these passes done. But it's a dangerous thing. Oh, it's a dangerous thing. It's a dangerous thing. The, oh, get off of me. The Desperation clone is on. Desperation. Uh, it's mixed with a bit of uh, my new scent, which is called Arrogance. Or uh, co Mistaken Confidence, maybe. But uh, here we go. Uh, we're, we're slicing through the field. My Mooney Ninja uh, avatar is in full effect. Because I, I have... I just think I got some speed today. So we'll take advantage of it. Ah, it could be out. And Vettel, what's Vettel doing way back here? Hey, buddy. We get to race a uh, living F1 le legend, guys. How exciting. Try to be patient. Whoops, I'm gonna try to be patient. Oh, we get DRS now. Whoops, that wasn't good. Gotta keep it clean, just gotta remind myself, be patient. Choose your moments wisely. So sketchy coming out of those corners. To not loop it. It's hard to keep the to get the power down without lighting it up. The energy storm is getting warm, reducing our overall capacity. The more charge you hold, the faster that capacity will drop. So I guess I need to read up on the energy store, because I don't know how much I'm supposed to keep on hand. I haven't figured that out yet. Uh, I also got warnings about using the transmission too much or something or limiting its wear. I don't know how you do that. I'm just shifting when I need to shift. That kind of seems like that's how you drive a race car. But if there's some strategy to shifting, I'd love to know. Feel free to let me know in the comments how to shift. Once in a while, it feels like the, I don't know if it's my wheel or the game's not letting me downshift. This is a brand new transmission for this race. It actually is brand brand new because it wasn't even used in quality. Whoa. Are we in rich or in standard? I can't remember. I think we're in standard on fuel. Might be time to switch to rich. We're rich now. We're approaching the pit window. You'll be on mediums. Okay, I think we've kept it pretty clean before the pit stops. That's good. Watch out for the slowdown.
cuts it up, but she can't. We're giving it all she's got, Scotty. It's happening. We're on Rich, we're boosting with the ERS, we're DRSing. We're throwing every acronym at it. We just can't quite figure out how to get past Kvyat yet. Maybe once we pit, we'll be able to. If we can keep the car out of damage, hopefully we'll have a nice, quick, clean pit stop. And we can slip by him that way. That'd be nice. I think we got this slap plus one more, and then we'll be heading into the pits. Uh, I don't know if we should do this. We're doing it. I was just talking about how, it, how important it was to be damage free coming into the pits, and then I do that, and it worked. Whew. We had to get by him. I'd had enough of Kvyat. I do not regret the things I've done, but those I did not do. That's not true, I have lots of regrets. Oh, maybe that should be a cologne set. Oh, no, 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 I just talked about the damage and then I did the... Moon, what are you doing? Oh, guys, I'm trying to throw it away. We've worked our way up into 16th, though. That's pretty awesome. Let's see what this pit stop will cost us when it's time to do that. Might have cut that, I don't know. Game says no, so we'll go with no cut there. Which means I probably need to be more aggressive on the curbs in general. Wow, look at all these fancy names and fancy cars. We're racing above our pay grade. I guess we were up in the front at uh, Zamvor, right? And then we just couldn't hang on to it. Everything went horribly wrong, of course. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, Vettel's must be using his ERS. He's pulling away hard. So we're going to have to use ours to keep up. Am I pitting this lap? I think I'm pitting this lap. Yep, we are. Oh, don't do this. Don't do this. Let him go. No more damage. Okay, we'll box this lap, box this lap. We had, we were getting a little bit of run on Vettel, I think, but it's fine. Whew. Okay, hopefully this is a nice quick pit stop. We got a couple people pitting. Whew. Nice, it was, it was a damage free pit stop. We got a chance here, guys. Where are we coming out? We're coming out in 20th, but not everyone's done pit stops yet. So let's get some nice couple laps here to try to put together the best outlap I can. I think it's already a pretty bad one, to be honest. But that's all right. Oh. Yeah, these tires aren't quite as grippy as the softs. No surprise there. Oh, now let's get into Ridge. Now it's time to get some of those nice practice and quality laps I had. Got a nice clean track. For once, we're not compromised anywhere except by me, <laughs> which is a pretty big compromise, if we're being honest. But I'm excited about this. I think that pit stop went is just the way I wanted it to. We've got clean, clean arrow or clean air. 
We're running rich. This is our chance to really, really put it in. Nope, 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 nope. Yield. 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 Good. I don't want to fight for that place. I just want to... <laughs> I just want to do my own thing and chase this McLaren. I don't know if it's Lando or if it's Sainz. The car behind has boxed for the mediums. Car behind on the medium tire. Car's feeling pretty good though. I got to be careful getting you know power down, but that's always going to be the case. Setup's not going to fix that, but this is feeling pretty good. We're catching up with people. Hopefully the engine can handle all of this uh, rich fuel running, but car's feeling good. We're in 13th, guys. So I don't really need to boost too much. Let's go back into uh, standard. That was the fastest lap of the race. Nice. Oh, okay. This is really scary. We're gonna do an unmoony GT thing and yield. Live to fight another day, I hope. Come on, car. I don't know who that was. Okay, clear. Whoops, I got distracted by watching the AI battle. Ooh, we gotta run. Can we do anything on Sains? Probably not. We're in 10th, guys. Oh my god. Too much pressure. Hang in there. Okay, you're in the top ten. Oh. Nope, not again. So we've got the inside this time. Got this to arch. You know what? Oh. That was scary. Oh my goodness. Two titans of their craft going going at it. Mooney GT and Carlos Sainz. Oh, so much focus now, guys. We're we're having a good race. Fuel target is plus one. Faster engine modes are available. Are we in rich? Oh, we gotta run. Where are you going, buddy? Not this time. See ya. Wow, look at all these fancy cars and fancy names. If you're watching, I wonder if he's gonna take the drink. I don't know. Hopefully, he's gonna yield the position. How much time we got left? We're on lap 12. Okay. He. Wow. Wow, that was scary. Ricardo. The Apollo Racing Program is on a tear. Hopefully they can hang on and they won't throw it all away. We won't mess with Ricardo yet. 
but soon. We're coming for you, buddy. He's defending. We're so careful coming out of that corner. Oh guys, I'm having a hard time chattering away because they're we're actually racing today. <laughs> Trying to hang in there. That wasn't a very good uh, lap so far, but Oh, we got to run on him. Whoa, buddy. We have five laps of fuel remaining. Yikes. <laughs> oh, man, we're in fifth. Sort of. I mean, we kind of were aggressive there. But... Is that enough fuel? Guys. A podium is in sight. Oh my gosh. Do we have enough fuel to run and let's go to standard for a little bit. Five laps of fuel. Four laps to go. Yeah, let's go back down to standard. Good thing I put this pace is strong, but be aware your tires need to go the distance. Oh, I want that full power though. Oh my gosh, guys, we're flying today. There's not much difference between me and an airplane. No DRS, though. Oh, we're out of, we're out of uh, URS, so there's that. Oh, the tires are starting to get a little squirrely. It's about time to go to Rich. It's okay, Tatiana, I believe in you. Oh, I don't want to do this. I'm not going to. <laughs> it's like I'm about to be on the inside of that corner. I don't want to. I shouldn't be. Look at that. I'm growing, guys. Before your very eyes, I'm growing up. We're going to Rich. Why did he do that? No! He left the door open! Guys! No! Oh, I was about to say we can salvage the top 10, but maybe not. Oh no, it was all my fault. <laughs> I was just talking about all of my individual growth. We had a chance to at least finish fourth or fifth or whatever it was, if not get on the podium or something insane, and I threw it all away. Oh, Moon, that was bad. So bad. Someday we'll learn. We had a couple laps to see what we can do. I'm dropped down to mix one. I don't want to run out of fuel. We're going to hang on to the places we can hang on to. We've already passed all these people. Oh, well, that was a bummer, guys. My bad. Oops, I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to. <laughs> the, if you missed it the first time, there was the replay. Woo. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, gosh. They... Uh, 
seconds. <laughs> Three seconds. They they just come into that turn so wide and it's so like uh, tempting. Oh gosh, is the car really damaged this time? Maybe, maybe not. Maybe we're just sliding around. Oh, uh, what a what a day. What a day. We were given this great opportunity and I threw it all away. The team should be pretty mad at me right now. Jeff won't be happy. You're right, Jeff. It was really bad. I guess we're lucky that we didn't have more damage than that. We're still actually going around the circuit with a chance to get into 15th, maybe? What a waste. through this uh, chicane. All it took was there to not be another car there for me to run into. Oh boy, guys. Well, hopefully this will be the, gosh, dirty tires now, probably. Hopefully this will be the, uh, the lesson I had to learn, right? I don't think we had a race like this. I have had mistakes before, sure. But this one hurts. This one, I actually had stuff to lose. And patience would have been a virtue. So we got one more lap. We should probably be able to go into standard and be fine on fuel. This is your final lap. Final lap of the race. Wow, what a day. Tough lessons learned by the Apollo Racing Program. lesson though because we have the opportunity to maybe no unless I were too far away from Magnuson you're safe buddy maybe maybe we can get him in the hairpin if we no well maybe we can Oh, guys, maybe we can get him. Oh, we don't have DRS, though. DRS would have would have helped. Oh, we're out of ERS. I thought about it. I thought about it, guys. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. Well, that's finally it. After running basically two races, <laughs> because the first one died on me. I'm exhausted. That was a lot of race car driving, but thanks for coming along. I promise you, we might have learned a lesson, possibly. Find out next week when we go to, I don't know where, but uh, I'm looking forward to it. I'm really enjoying these races. I'm, I'm enjoying F1. I think I'm starting to understand the car a little bit better and, and improving my driving skill, if not my racing skill, uh, a little bit. But anyways, thanks for coming along. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you next time.